Hello lovelies, I'm back and I'm here to talk to you today about one of the Mothbox books uh, which is Call of the Undertow by Linda Cracknell. I decided I'd start reading this as my first book of 2017 because from reading the back of it it sounded like quite a wintry read and I was absolutely right. Now I gave this book four stars. I gave it four stars for a number of things. It was it was a very easy read. I didn't feel like I had to force myself to get through it at any point. I thought the story was absolutely brilliant. The story is about a cartographer called Maggie and something bad happens. We don't know what it is, but she moves basically to the back end of nowhere, right at the top, Scotland. It's very rural there and she's decided to work remotely while she prepares this atlas that she's making for her employer. Now when she's there she gets to know the locals and she ends up going to talk in a school where she has a connection with a strange loner boy called Trothan. They hit it off and they form a sort of relationship when he ends up coming round to her house and making his own map as a project for, for the school. It's about the dynamics of the relationship between those two and how she gets on with the people in the town and also how she's dealing with whatever bad thing it was that happened. We don't know what the bad thing is until until quite later on, so I won't talk about it here. Uh, there's also a small magical element in this story, which I really liked. And you never know whether it is a magical element or whether it's not when you're going through the book. And I love that it leaves it sort of up to the reader's own mind to decide for themselves. Now this was an absolutely perfect read for a wintry morning. I ended up getting through this in I think three days. It was just so beautifully written, absolutely lovely. It definitely made me want to live by the sea. I think I watched uh, Mercedes review of it yesterday and it, it really resonated. I thought exactly the same, like when when the way sometimes when you read a book and these people live in these, they move to these rural areas and they describe the sights and the sounds and the walking and the outside and it really makes you feel like you'd want to be there, like you'd want to experience that and I found that with this book. I really enjoyed the description of the map building that Trotham was doing as Maggie taught him to build it in layers and to add different bits onto it. It was just really well described. Sorry about the noise, that's one of, one of my ferrets running around. And I felt like the author really delved into what the dynamics of each of those relationships would work like. There's also a few little mysteries that happen in there as well. Again, I won't I won't talk about it too much. But overall, I just thought it I was gripped from start to finish. The world building was really good and I definitely want to read more by her. So that's my review of Call of the Undertow. If you've read this, please let me know what you thought of it. If you're looking to take part in the next Mothbox subscription, I'll leave a link down below. I don't think Mercedes has released it yet, but I think it is going to be soon. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and please subscribe to follow me for more content. I'll be back in a day or two with another video. Okay, thank you. Big hugs. <laughs>